the name's uh, Mick and uh, I'm here to play walking football today. It's the second session of the week and uh, looking forward to a little bit of a, I can't say run round because that's against the rules. Well, stubble's in now, isn't it? I guess so. I He's eyeing the stubble. We've uh, got quite a, a big mixture of the membership. Uh, I'm one of the babies of the group, actually, at uh, coming up to 57. There's uh, one or two a little bit younger than me, just sort of 55, 56. But I think the average age of the group is into the mid-60s now. It's um, getting older and larger all the time. Well, I know of people within the group that have been unfortunate enough to lose partners. And as well as the, the physical well-being they get from it, They've told me about the mental well-being, how that's improved with the, the friendships they've created and the inclusivity of being around everybody. I love it because it, make, like, it makes me feel happy. My name's Kate, I'm Lexi's mum. Her confidence has soared massively. She's such, she's, she just loves, absolutely loves coming to the gym. She comes every single day without fail. She works really hard. At the beginning I didn't really know what I was really doing, but then now I can just do anything I want in there. We have the adapted bikes and the rebound therapy in the hall with us this morning. Um, some of the clients have already arrived and are on the facilities, and it's just generally a get-together session as much as a health promotion session. I like coming to the leisure centre and meeting my friends and kind staff will help I love the trampoline best. Oh my friends here and I love meeting different people. My name is Matt Tease. I'm me Tease and I'm wife to Matt Tease. This group is unbelievably important to me for Matt. Say, so, right, we're going to Sport and Memories. Oh, I'm tired, I want to sleep. <sighs> I've never been there before, but we'll be coming two years in June from the onset. I park the car, we walk in, and the minute he sees everybody, it's like a light goes on. <laughs> oh, it's meeting people and all that, you know. I, I meet people again now, which I used to meet years ago when I played football. You know, they used to play as well, and I, I meet them here now. The social aspect, the integrating with other people. He's finding the quizzes and photographs a bit more difficult than we did two years ago because obviously dementia's progressive. But the difference in that man, it's like somebody <laughs> opening the curtains. My name's Debbie, um, I'm here because Four years ago, I had a stroke. I was in the hospital for two months. Um, it, um, I wasn't sure how bad it was. My parents and my husband and my children told me. About a year on, I came up to the leisure centre to find out about it. About it and, and I really liked it. I love it here because there's loads of people that, um, you know, there's, there's all sorts to, to talk to. When I first started, I couldn't even talk. Before, I, I didn't know how to hold on, but um, now I think, you know, I can just, just about do it. When I first came out, came here, I was in a wheelchair and now I can drive myself. And we've all made so many friends. It's a one in a million, yeah. It's nice to see them come over here and achieve something, don't you? You all, you all come on and you, you all build up confidence each week as you come. You all get better, don't you, at doing things. You try new sports as well, don't you? You're fun up. The banter in the changing rooms after that is, is really good, especially for the people that perhaps didn't play so seriously when they were younger and enjoyed taking part now. If they've scored a goal, it's good to big them up to be part of that. It's great for them. I'd say go because it just helps you and it just makes your life easier. <laughs> Amazing. <laughs>